Hey, what's going on guys? It is Old School Matt here, back with another Water Buffalo Training Method video. Today we're gonna to be starting a new YouTube series. It's gonna be called Motivational Monday. Hey, what's going on guys? It is Old School Matt here, back with another Water Buffalo Training Method video. Today we're going to be starting a new YouTube series. It's going to be called Motivational Monday, uh, or Matt's Motivational Monday videos. Uh, we're just going to be picking a word and we're going to be kind of going off these words. Uh, I think it's going to be a great series because it's going to be raw, it's going to be unedited, it's going to be purely me speaking to the camera. I'm going to be talking about a lot of different words, a lot of different ideas and aspects of life that I feel like are very important. In today's video, we're going to be talking about persistency. The reason why we're going to be talking about persistency is because today marks one year of Water Buffalo Training Method being open uh, or being started. It is a pleasure and is an honor for me to be able to develop this business and be surrounded by the people that I'm surrounded by. And it's all thanks to one word and that word is persistency. So the word persistency and what it means to me, persistency means being dedicated, being committed towards something and doing it day in and day out no matter how the effect of that thing is no matter what the outcome of that thing is you do it no matter what um, for example I've learned persistency through many facets of my life one of them being the gym I've been training since I was 13 14 years old and I haven't missed you know more than a week of working out in my entire life ever other than injuries and whatnot but that is something that's kept me persistent in one aspect of my life and I've been able to push it through towards water buffalo uh, for the past year I can say that I would say 98 to 99% of all my days have had some sort of influence in this business. I've tried my best to keep persistent each and every day. Obviously, we all slip up, but the key word about this word is that the more you do, the more persistent you'll be. The more persistent you are, the better you'll be. So obviously, being perfect is not going to be very feasible for many, many of us, but having the mindset of being persistent will reach us towards perfection. So as much as we can be persistent, as many times, as many days we're able to stay persistent is what's going to help us achieve our goals, help us continue to grow our brands, our businesses, our, you know, our school, our studies, our relationships with others. Um, so being persistent is a very important aspect of anyone's life and it should always be taught um, whether you're trying to, like I said, build a relationship, build a business, uh, go to school, become a parent, anything you're trying to do, being persistent is one of the most important aspects of this. And it is one of the important aspects of being successful in what you do. Uh, persistency can come in many forms. The way I like to think of persistency is being able to stay dedicated at all times to what you're doing. It's a very extreme way of thinking of persistency. Obviously, you can be persistent at something and you know still kind of give it um, not all your 100%, but being persistent to me means to truly give each and every ounce of your free capabilities towards something that you think that is worth it for your future. Obviously for me, it's the business. Um, some examples of how I'm persistent is that each and every day when I wake up, I try to do something in the morning that has to be, rela has to be related towards the business, has to be related towards building the brand or helping clients or helping you know people that are on the program or putting people you know, with motivational content or helping people get through their day, whatever that might be for building the brand, that's what I think persistency is for me. I'm also persistent in other ways in my life. I'm a student at the University of Florida, I try to stay on top of my studies, I'm persistent in the gym. I've been killing it in the gym, maybe not as much as I'd like to, but I'm there. And that's one of the other aspects of persistency is that you don't have to give it your 100%, you just need to show up. So as much as you show up, as much as you give your all, you're gonna be part of a small club of people and that word persistency means a lot to that small club of people um, for those of you guys who already know that know this and practice this this is just more fuel to your fire keep doing keep being persistent and for those of you guys who are trying to start a brand trying to develop their, themselves uh, being persistent is extremely important in anything if you're not you know you're not knocking on the door every morning no one's going to open up if you're not calling that person they're not going to pick up obviously there is exceptions to these rules if you're you know in a relationship that's not working and the person doesn't want to be with you anymore and you being a persistent it's probably not going to help your cause if you're running a business that's obviously not profitable or has no you know no sense of upward mobility and you've been stuck and you've done everything you can it might be time to call it quits um you know there might be a job that you've been trying to get for a long time and obviously you're not going to get that job so you know bringing realism into the aspect of the whole self-help motivational um, sort of vibe that we all try to go for and we all try to pursue 
um, is important. But you know, the main key for today is being persistent and always trying to stay as persistent as you possibly can. Keep knocking on the door, keep showing up, keep, you know, if you're on social media, keep posting, keep putting stuff out there. Um, it's like keep throwing stuff at the wall until something sticks. That's one of my mentalities in life. And you know, you might waste some time here and there, but nothing's a waste of time. It's always a learning experience. You always learn more. I can't tell you how many times I've been either editing a video, trying to work on something for the website, writing a program where I've done something completely wrong, wasted 10, 12, 30, 40 hours of my time, probably thousands of hours of my time, wasted thousands of letters, words. Um, but the main thing is that if you keep throwing something, it'll stick. Stay persistent, stay dedicated, stay motivated. It's Monday, let's get after it. Let's make sure that we stay as dedicated and as motivated towards our goals as possible. And let's keep going, guys. I hope you guys are having a great day and I hope you guys enjoy your day and your week. And um, let's stay motivated. I can't wait to keep doing these videos. And if I can, I'm gonna start bumping them up and do more than one a week. But let's stay to one a week on Monday. And I hope you guys are enjoying. I hope you guys are staying tuned for all our content. Water Buffalo Training Method, we're out. Hey guys, thank you guys for checking out this video. We're so grateful to have you here on our YouTube channel. So make sure to check out all of our other videos ranging from a variety of different types of podcasts to our Buffalo barbecues. Check out our YouTube channel for constant updates on all the stuff that we have going on. You can also follow us on social media like Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook. So check us out there. Water Buffalo Training Method, we're out.